Hi, this is Caleb Gedkin. Today I'll be giving you a list of 12 Bible verses about divorce. Let's pray before we get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for your Holy Spirit and being Lord of our lives and Savior of our lives. Please show us what you want us to learn and apply it to our lives. If it's in your will, Heavenly Father, name, pray, amen. Let's get started. Number one, this explains why a man leaves his father and mother and is joined to his wife, and the two are united into one. Genesis 2.24 Number two, the Lord himself will fight for you. Just stay calm. Exodus 14, 14. Number three, read Deuteronomy 24, verses 1 through 22 on your own time. Number four, for I hate divorce, says the Lord, the God of Israel. To divorce your wife is to overwhelm her with cruelty, says the Lord of heaven's army. So guard your heart. Do not be unfaithful to your wife. Malachi 2.16 Number 5 You have heard the law that says a man can divorce his wife by merely giving her a written notice of divorce. But I say that a man who divorces his wife unless she has been unfaithful causes her to commit adultery. And anyone who marries a divorced woman also commits adultery. Matthew 5.31 and 32 Number 6 Some Pharisees came and tried to trap him with this question. Should a man be allowed to divorce his wife for just any reason? Haven't you read the scriptures? Jesus replied, They record that from the beginning God made the male and female. And he said, This explains why a man leaves his father and mother and is joined to his wife, and the two are united into one. Since they are no longer two but one, let no one split apart, but God is joined together. Then why did Moses say in the law that a man could give his wife a written notice of divorce and set her away? they asked. Jesus replied, Moses permitted divorce only as a concession to your hard hearts, but it was not what God had originally intended. And I tell you this, whoever divorces his wife and, and marries someone else commits adultery unless his wife has been unfaithful. Matthew nineteen three through 9 Number 7. He told them, Whoever divorces his wife and marries someone else commits adultery against her. And if a woman divorces her husband and marries someone else, she commits adultery. Mark 10, 11, and 12. Number 8. For example, a man who divorces his wife and marries someone else commits adultery. And anyone who marries a woman divorced from her husband commits adultery. Luke 16, 18. Number 9. For example, when a woman marries, the law binds, to her, binds her to her husband as long as he is alive. But if he dies, the laws of marriage no longer apply to her. So while her husband is alive, she would be committing adultery if she married another man. But if her husband dies, she is free from that law and does not commit adultery when she remarries. Romans 7, 2, and 3. Number 10. Read 1 Corinthians 7, 1 through 40 in your own time. Number 11. Give honor to marriage and remain faithful to one another in marriage. God will surely judge people who are immoral and those who commit adultery. Hebrews 13, 4. Number 12. And we can be sure that, if, that we know him if we obey his commandments. If someone claims, I know God, but doesn't obey God's commandments, that person is a liar and is not living in the truth. But those who obey God's word truly show how completely they love him. This is how we know we are living in him. 1 John 2, 3-5. I hope these Bible verses were helpful and you enjoyed this video. Please let me know what you think, learned, or any questions you have in the comments section below. Please be polite and respectful. God loves you and I love you too. Bye.